In this video, I will show you how to quickly and easily leverage trade Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies on the 2Bit exchange trading platform. If you want to create an account on 2Bit, you can simply go down to the video description, click on the link and you will get to exactly this page right here and you will automatically be able to get the best sign up bonus possible. You can actually get up to $9,210 of bonuses. The first $10 you can easily get by just signing up and then transferring at least $10 to your futures trading account. I will show you all of that in just a bit. Also, if you're using the copy trading functionality up to $200 of losses will completely be covered and the last up to $9,000 you can get by depositing and trading these amounts and then you can see how much of a bonus you will get. If you've used the link from the description you can get all of these bonuses you just have to enter your details right here or use one of these buttons and then you're ready to go. Once you have created an account and you log in for the first time the page will look like this. First thing I want to show you is of course how you can deposit money. First I will show you how to deposit crypto. You simply go up here and click on deposit then you can choose the cryptocurrency you want to deposit, Bitcoin or any other ones that you would like. I, for example, like to use US dollar Tether. You can just click on it here, choose a network. I, for example, like to use the Tron network and then you will get your deposit address right here. You can send crypto here from another exchange or your wallet and then it will be here within seconds without any fees. Also, I want to show you how you can also deposit with fiat currency. So if you have euro or US dollars, you simply go here up to the left top, click on buy crypto then credit and debit card. Then you can choose your fiat currency that you want to deposit with. All of these ones are, are available. For example, 500 euro. Then you have to choose the cryptocurrency that you want to receive because you cannot hold fiat on the platform, but you can basically buy it and then you will have some crypto on here. For example, US dollar tether. I have to type in 500 again and then I'll receive this amount of US dollar tether. I can choose one of these different payment providers. Click on buy with Eero. I have to be verified on the account. Um, this is the only step where you have to be verified. Anything else, depositing with crypto or just leverage trading with crypto, you don't need to be verified on here. But if you want to use uh, the fiat on-ramp system right here through a third party uh, by using Visa card, Apple Pay and so on, then you have to be verified. It takes up to 10 to 20 minutes and then the money will be here and then you can trade with it. You can of course always check if the money has already arrived by just going up here to your assets. Just click on it once and then you will get to this page and then you can see it should arrive here in the spot account if the money that you have deposited already has arrived. Um, if you want to transfer it to your futures account, I also want to show you that because if you want to trade with it, you need it in your futures account. Simply go here, click on transfer, choose from your spot account to your futures account, select the currency US dollar tether we need, and then just click on confirm and then you will have it here on your futures account and then you can leverage straight with it. All right, so next up, let's take a look at the trading platform. To do that, we simply go up here to derivatives and then click on USDT perpetual futures. And then we will get to this page right here. It might look a little bit complicated at the beginning, but I will show you everything step by step right now. First of all, you can choose your trading pair up here in the top left corner. You can simply go here and then choose Ethereum, Bitcoin, any other cryptocurrency or also you can search for one. Down below, you will have the chart right here, the price chart. You can switch between this one from 2-bit or the typical trading view chart if you prefer this one. Here on the right, you will have the order book, all the selling orders up here in the market and down here, all the buying orders. Down here in this section, you will see all of your open positions. We will get into that in just a bit. And also your open orders, your history, and you could also see a detailed view of your assets. You can also see your assets here on the right side. Everything that you have deposited on your futures account, you will see right here. And up here, this is the control station where we can open our trades, choose our leverage and so on. All right, let's actually open a position. I will show you everything you need to know right here. So we want to open a position. Next up, we can choose our leverage. In here, I would recommend you just use isolated. Then you can choose your leverage. You can use an up to 100x leverage. In this case, I want to show you one with a 5x leverage. Click on confirm Then you have everything set up here. Then you can choose between a limit or market order. With a limit order, you could set a certain price at which you want the order to be executed. And with a market order, which also I would recommend you, you don't have that field because you will just open the position right now at the current market price. Then you can choose the position size. I have set a 5x leverage, so if I type in, for example, you can switch here the view between US dollar or Bitcoin. I have it now in US dollar. Let's say I want to open a $100 position. That would mean down here you can see how much of your own capital you would use for a long or a short position. In this case, it's $20, round about $20. 
which is of course this times five equals the $100 position size. It doesn't match up exactly because in the background you can see it's 0.003 Bitcoin. So it's in Bitcoin numbers and you don't have that too many numbers behind the decimal point, but uh, it works it's kind of so like this times five is the $100. If I type in, for example, 200, this would mean around about $40 times five equals the $200. So that's how it works. Um, for example, let's say $200, this is my position size. You could also use the side controller if you want to do so. For example, if I put that to 100%, that would mean I'm using all of my margin that I have down here. And then my position size will be, of course, this times five, around about $650. Let's go in for that with li uh, like that. Then you can also set a take profit and stop loss. You can just click on here. And then if you click on advanced, you will also see some more options. I want to open a long position in this case, let's say at $32,000, I want to close my position. This would mean a price increase of $8. I can switch this to market. So it closes immediately at that price. That would mean a $53 profit. Same goes for stop loss. Let's say the price goes down to $29,000, 1.5% down. I want my position to be closed, that would mean a $9 loss. So I can set these two up like that, click on confirm and then I have it all set. Now I can open my position, simply click on buy long right here. You will see everything, the position size, in this case, of course, my $120 times five equals this position size. I can see my take profit and stop loss, click on open long, and then I have my position opened. You will see all the important information about the position down here. So let's go through all of these different details. First of all, you can see it's a Bitcoin trade with a 5x leverage. I can see the entire position size. I can see my profit. So since I've opened the position, the price has increased a little bit. So I'm 4 cents on a profit right now, 0.03%. I can see my entry price where I entered the position. I can see the current price right here and the liquidation price. So if I don't, if I would not have a stop loss set, which I currently have, because we did it in the beginning, as you remember, then if the price goes down this much to $23,600, then my position would be closed automatically and I would lose all of my margin, my own capital that I've put into this trade, which I can see here again. Remember, I put it at 100%, so that would mean this $123 that I took of my own capital in this trade currently times five equals this position size, of course, just to remind you. And I would lose this at a liquidation price. Of course, I can prevent that by setting a take profit and stop loss. You might wonder why it's not visible in here. Um, it is still there, but you just cannot see it here because it's under open orders and then take profit and stop loss. You can see them both here at $29,000 my stop loss and at $32,000 my take profit. If I want to edit these or cancel them and add new ones, I can simply cancel them right here. They're not there anymore. And if I go to positions again, I can also add them here. Or if I would have, for example, forgotten them to add them in the beginning here, I can always do that here as well. I just have to click on here, type in a price, for example, $31,000. That would mean a $30 profit, let's say $29,100, a $7 loss at that price. Just click on confirm and you've set it all up again. And if I check here, of course, I can see these orders here again. But now since I've done it here, I can also see them at any point here and I can also edit them at any point. So that's how you can edit your take profit and stop loss later on, or even add them if you forgot to add them at the beginning, you can later on add them here too. All right, so now I can just wait until the position uh, moves up or down and hits either my take profit or stop loss. Or of course, if at any point I want to take some profits, for example, I can close the position at any time too. Uh, for example, now I have two cents of profit. I can just go here, click on market. That means closing the position immediately. I can choose how much percent of the position I want to close, let's say 100%, all of it, and then just click on close long, and then I'm out of the position again. Don't forget to create an account on 2Bit by using the link down from the video description to get the up to $9,210 of bonuses, the best sign up bonus possible, and if you have any other questions, always feel free to ask them in the comments.